Look around your classroom and see who in your school family is not here today. Let's put them in our hearts and let's wish them well. We wish you well. We wish you well. All through the day today, we wish you well. Now send out all your love and well wishes. Hi, I'm Olivia Claudio. I am a Mr. Music class. And please donate two plates for the homeless people that want to be clean. My name is Alan Guzman, and I am Ms. Morgan's in class. Please come and give two plates for the people who need it most. Hi, I'm Esteban. I'm a Stella, and I'm from Ms. Morgan's class. and. He will bring these items for the homeless because they need it most. My name is Jaden Ramos. I'm in Miss Yvonne's, Miss Yvonne's girls class. And you should donate this to the homeless so they can stay clean. This is the Student Council. And we have a children's box. Good morning, boys and girls. Happy Thursday. The library is closed today and tomorrow for inventory, but I'm excited because I have a lot of reading incentive prizes to give away. The reading incentive prizes come from the prize dispenser in the library, the thing that looks like this. For the students who are earning a prize, I will give you quarters and you turn the knob and then a little capsule will come out. If you get a number one in the capsule, you get to choose a special bookmark that's yours to keep. We have lots of different kinds of bookmarks to choose from. If you turn the knob and a capsule comes out with number two in it, you get to choose a special eraser.
If you get number three from the prize dispenser, you get a top secret UV pen. And if you get number four, you get to choose a free book, a book that is yours to keep. So let's figure out who's getting prizes. Well, I know last week on the announcements, I talked about the reader leaders. Some of those kids I forgot to give the quarters to when they came for class. So these students still need to come to the library to get their prize. That is Tylan and Layla from pre-K, Miss Alanis's class, Sharon and Manuel from Miss Valenzuela's class in kindergarten, Kimberly and Juana Mora from Miss Garcia in first grade, Morelli and Genesis from second grade, Miss Mesa's class, Joshua L. and Camila from Ms. Gomez's third grade class. Fourth graders already got their prize. And then Jaden and Marcos from Ms. Rayburn Scott class. So those kids are able to come down to get a prize for being reader leaders. I'm also giving away prizes for our top AR students. So these are the students who have over 20 points in AR that means they've been taking the AR quizzes, they've been earning points, and they have an average score of 70% or above. That means they're scoring well on the test too. They're answering a lot of those questions right. Carlos has 92 points in fourth grade dual language. Levi has 75 points in Ms. Yvonne Guedes class. Giel from Ms. Ferguson has over 50 points in AR. Camila, Jeremiah, Julio, and Sasha from second and third grade dual language are doing really well with their AR. And so are Sophia and Katie from Ms. Munoz's class. So if you see your name here, kids, that means you are able to come down and get a prize from our reading incentive prize dispenser. You kids have over 20 points in AR and you have an average score of 70% or above. Now there are a lot of other students who are earning prizes for AR. These are students who don't quite have 20 points yet, but they have been earning a lot of points. They are the top readers after the 20 points who also score 70% or above on the quizzes. In fourth grade, Damien, Raul, and Gabby from Dual Language. In third grade, Julian, Patricio, and Maritza. In second grade, Jonathan, Doris, and Maria Jose. And then our top AR students for first grade are Elaine, Faith, and Penny. If you see your name here, that means you are able to come down and get a prize from our prize dispenser. Finally, I want to recognize our top beanbag, beanstack students. Remember, beanstack is where you can go to log your reading minutes. Beanstack is that icon on your class link that looks like the yellow heart with the decorations around it. And when you click on that, you're able to put in how many minutes you read. So these are the students who have the most minutes in each grade level, over a hundred minutes, and some even over a thousand minutes. In fourth grade, that's Raul, Gabby, Carlos, Corbin, and Michaela. Good job, fourth graders, and you can see how many minutes you have logged. In third grade, Elijah, Gial, Jeremiah, Ariel, and Julian. In second grade, Sophia, Leah, Brian, Byron, Emery, and Juven. Those are our second graders. And then for first grade, we have Elaine and Santiago. If you see your name on this list, that means you can come down and get a prize from our prize dispenser. You might see your name on this list and on an AR list. If you saw your name twice, you'll be able to get two prizes. You will have more opportunities to earn prizes from the Reading Prize Dispenser. Just keep on taking AR quizzes, logging those Beanstack minutes, and hopefully you'll have an opportunity too to be a reader leader sometime this year. 
So again, boys and girls, if you saw your name on that list, you're able to come to the library. I will give you quarters to get a prize from the prize dispenser. Please come tomorrow, Friday, anytime during the day. Teachers, you can send them anytime Friday. Even though the door in the library will say that the library is closed for inventory, y'all are able to come in, come in on Friday to get those prizes from the prize dispenser. Please do not send students today because there is an admin meeting going on early afternoon that I don't want interrupted. So Friday, write it down, make a note, send those students tomorrow for their prizes. Have a great day and a happy, happy Christmas to you. Bye. Hey everybody, let's take our breath together, our three deep breaths together, and then let's choose how we're feeling the emotion that is inside of us today. Here we go, breathing in, uh, breathing in, two, three, four, and hold, and out. Breathing in, and hold, and out. One last time, breathe in and hold it and out. Okay, then look at the feelings chart and choose the feeling that you're, the emotion that you're feeling today. And let's say these words to ourselves. And in between each word, every two, between each phrase, let's take a deep breath then. I am safe. I am cold. I can handle this. Okay. Remember, it's a great day to be a tiger. Goodbye, guys.